Hi and welcome to this tip for Microsoft Excel. Now um, what I'm going to show you here is actually kind of neat. It's how to change the active cell or the direction of the active cell after you hit the enter key. So whenever I hit enter the cell is automatically going to move down, right? So if I go up here and I hit enter it always moves down. I have to use the arrow key to move it elsewhere. But you can't use arrow keys when entering data. You have to hit enter, right? So this is how you can change the direction of the where the next active cell is going to be after you hit enter. Go to the office button, Excel options, go to the advanced tab, then at the very top in editing options, it says after pressing enter, move selection. So by default it's down, but you can move it to any one of these. So let's say we want to move it right. Now every time I hit enter, it goes to the right. Pretty cool. So you can change it to up or anything else. So actually, um, how to get back there again? Office button, Excel options, advanced tab, editing options right here. Let's change it so it goes up. Pretty cool, yeah. So that way you don't always have to hit shift enter or shift tab or tab when um, doing that. So office button, or when entering data. Office button, Excel options, advanced tab, and let's set it back to the default down. Now the last thing is, you may notice there is a checkbox next to this after pressing enter move selection well uncheck that and enter isn't going to move it anywhere so when I start typing I get the same cell it is the same thing as hitting control enter on the keyboard so that's a, a neat way that you can change what the enter key is actually going to do uh, while you're in Excel and depending on the type of data you're entering can be very helpful or you can change that on a coworker's computer and just annoy the hell out of them. So that's about it for this tip. I'll show you how to get to it one more time because I think too often in video tutorials people just breeze through things. So to get to where you can change where the enter will move the active cell, go to the office button, Excel options, advanced tab very top under editing options it says after pressing enter move selection I'm going to recheck that box and you can choose any one of these options here so that's it for this tip